to sign such a decree. Yeah. How many of us ever done some stuff we wish we never would have done before? All right, all but right. I stopped by to tell you, it's over now. Over. It's gone. You got to look out for my comeback. Can I talk in here? Even though it didn't destroy me, right. even though it didn't turn me up, yeah. you got to watch out for my comeback. Yeah. Can I preach in here? Preach. My God in here. Yeah. He said, Daniel, yeah. your God will deliver you. Yeah. Yes, God. And as he began to deal in the text, yeah, yeah my God, he said, why was I so silly? Right. Why did I allow this thing to happen? Yeah. How many know that Daniel was pushed into the den of lions and the door was sealed and the king went back home to the palace and at the palace the king said don't bring me no music no i don't want to eat nothing how many know saints fasting and prayer is going to get up through this pandemic all right the king fasted all evening. Yeah. The king fasted all night long. Now he said, I'm not eating anything. Because I can imagine in my mind the lions turn Daniel to pieces. But how many know that God is going to do some great things yes. in the midst of the pandemic? All that right, we're dealing all with? right. Can I talk in here? How many know great exports? are coming out of this. Yeah. How many know it means heroic deeds? God is getting ready to stretch some people right. who have never been stretched. All right. God is getting ready to elevate some people who's never been elevated. All right. How many know I hear the William brothers in my mind? He said, I'm just a nobody trying to tell everybody about somebody in hell. How many know that God is getting ready to take you a young your throat something comfort zones. You're going to step out on things because God brought it to it. He's going to bring me through it. How many know we're going to make it through this? All right. But all night long the king worried. And how many know even though he made a statement he said God going to deliver you. Have you ever told somebody that God going to deliver you? Yeah. And the devil trying to make you doubt it. But early in the morning time, King Daniel, King Darius, as he go down to the den, he looking over in the den, he began to cry out in a lamented voice. I Meaning he was already crying because he thought Daniel was already dead. He said, Daniel, Daniel, did your God, did he deliver you? Yeah. And how many know he didn't hear nothing? How many ever called on God and you didn't hear nothing? It's just like the GPS. When you don't hear nothing, keep on driving. Keep on going forward. That means that God is leading you to your destination. It's a neighbor. I'm gonna make it. Thank you. Thank you. Are you here? I'm make it. How many know he cried out? Yes. Daniel, did your God deliver you? Yes. And how many know he didn't hear nothing? All right. He began to weep within himself. How many ever cried about something that you thought was over? And we came. With the narrative, he might not come when he wanted, right. but he's always on time. How many know he can be ten days late yes. and still be on time? Oh, yeah. Because he controls the narrative. Yes. Because he is God. Yeah. He is God. Yes. And he is able to bring me out.